in Missouri, the country, and his wife, Pastor E. And then to Pastor Crip, to Pastor Finn, and his lovely wife. We're going to put on the spot. That's all right. For all of our pastors that are here, amen. These two lovely women of God, amen. These pastors here. Amen. I, I know I'm missing a, a, a Pastor Clark. Praise God. Oh, Lord. I like that woman. Praise the Lord. Amen. And to Minister Janet from St. Louis. Amen. Show me stay here. We got folk here. Amen. That's that country? Okay. Let's get our Bibles and let's get some word tonight. And we had a, we heard an awesome word last night, did, did we not? Amen. Yes. Amen. We had to say ouch. Yes. We had to say ouch. Yes. Come on. Yes. Amen. Romans chapter 12. Woo. Do you have that? Amen. Let's read uh, 1 and 2. Oh, yeah. Amen. Yeah. Let's stand for the reading of the word. How about that? Let's bear us to Lord. I beseech you. Therefore, brethren, by the mercies of God, that ye present your bodies a living sacrifice, holy acceptable unto God, which is your reasonable that this is service. And be not conformed to what world? But be ye oh, let's say it again. But be ye let's say it one more time. But be ye by the renewing of your mind. That ye may prove what is good and acceptable and perfect will of God. We were used for a topic tonight. Look at your neighbor in the eyeball and say, neighbor, get your mind right. Look at your other neighbor and say, neighbor, neighbor. get your mind right. right. Take your Holy Ghost, sit down. Can I do some prophetically teaching tonight? That's all right, Chief. So if I don't hoop, I'm already hooped all week long. Yes, sir. Amen. Ah, oh, God, we, we, we want to, amen, talk, get your mind right. Do you have the power to change? Have you been transformed? Uh -huh. uh, Paul is letting us know. Amen. Uh, he's beseeching us. Amen. That means that the Greek to call us out to help. Look at your neighbor and say, neighbor, neighbor. we're going to be friends tonight. So don't be looking at me crazy when the preacher say, neighbor. But tell your neighbor, say, neighbor, I need some help tonight. So I beseech you. Paul is begging, beseeching us to get our minds right. To be transformed. Amen. I beseech you. Therefore, brethren, sister, notice the commas in the scripture text. Notice how many times Paul had to stop and pause. Very important that we look at the commas and the periods and the semicolons in the world. 